Hi, you good people. Most radio hosts say, hello, all you good people out there. And I look at my computer screen and think, hello, all you good people in there. In is out and out is in. And we're all stuck in the middle somewhere. For most people, not knowing what's up and what's down anymore in this Ordo Apkau. But anyway, I'm glad to find you in there when I open the box. So therefore, I've really tried to maintain my personal relationship with all you in there. Like yesterday, spending the whole day trying to hit all those 600 plus comments on my last put in PPP film and at least leave some decent and personal answers to y'all. There you can see that 636 comments. So when I was answering, so I, I answered to all your 633 comments and a hundred or so comments in between by pasting a standard phrase for the initial conversation. Then this morning I wanted to check on some trolls I saw last night and who were insulting others in the comments and whom I therefore warned when I noticed that 95% of my answers on your comments weren't even there anymore. All my precious time wasted for nothing. Hours and hours of answering to your comments just down the drain. YouTube having, having stolen my whole day and a part of my evening. I'm sorry, folks. I seriously tried. I guess that after 20 or so of my answers, the machine recognized me as a spammer on my own channel without the sneaky bastards telling me so. And as the insulting trolls, therefore, didn't get my warning, I just terminated the tangos because I'd like to maintain a certain rules of engagement here in my channel in order to protect a friendly atmosphere among friends. So no insulting, no swearing at others. You swear at the government and its politricsters though. And if you don't behave, I'll shoot you down and push your button. Yes, you're there, in there. And as we're talking about shooting down and pushing buttons, I'd like to address myself to those belligerent Ruskies and their fascist leader. Hey, Putin, before you buy new nukes, you should use up the old ones first. No, no, just joking. I hope Mr. Putin doesn't listen as much to me as you do. By the way, my email address here in my channel is open for all who really want to organize with me in one way or another. Because I also need about 20,000 no-brainers like these here and create my own foreign legion to invade Switzerland 
and take Pharaoh's New World Order down. It says foreign fighters arrive to fight for Ukraine. All right, look at them, you know, look at them. Here's the flag. All right, look at them. What else should I say? Just look at their faces and their eyes, you know. I don't even want to repeat the word. I guess after two years of bug, terror, and lockdowns, most people are so frustrated and imprisoned that they are up to anything to let the build up frustrations out and ready for some adventure in a so called freedom fight and kick some ass. Not knowing that it's all part of Pharaoh's plan, needing some more cannon fodder for the Ruskies hungry cannons. I'll quote for you, cannon fodder, war has never been so much fun. It feels so good to be needed somewhere and to belong to a group after two years of lockdown loneliness. Yeah, let's kick some ass. I feel free again. It's okay, guys. President Zelensky with his Nazi Templar cross on his left side breast says it's legal. This is our master's technique to train a dog. Their dogs. You alternately pull the leash and keep it short. And then alternately loosen the leash. Over and over again. Until the doggy doggy understands and does it all by himself. And I quote, how to stop leash pulling, seven strategies to teach your dog to walk with a loose leash. On a very short leash for more than two long years and then abruptly loosening the leash, run doggy doggy. And I'll interpret the Ukrainian Foreign Legion logo for you. You see the sun here? There's the sun. You see the sun representing our master's god, Amun Ra. And only a falcon dives straight down like this. And the falcon stands for Horus and it's falling because this is the Horus matrix of the bred human race, their bred livestock with soldiers falling to their death, with man falling at the battlefield. And here in black is the inverted pyramid of death, just as in Auschwitz. So the bird is falling to its death. It, it says it all people, it's a trap. I have explained the Horus matrix in many of my videos. Like for instance, this one here entitled the Swiss beast, home of the devil or in my older videos here on my channel Gatsefrat, where I published these two videos on the Horus Matrix nine years ago. And look, here it is, doggy doggy, and the, uh, the loosened leash and the tight leash, now breeding humanity through the Horus Matrix. These damn creatures have completely analyzed us and know us better than we know ourselves and are now 
letting loose another 20,000 no-brainer attack dogs by their man with the Nazi Templar symbol on his chest to fight another 100,000 18-year-old Ruski kiddo soldiers forced to fight by the other Nazi maniac on the adversary side. Yes, you got it. Zelensky, the actor, is a good pal of Putin, the actor. All having great fun and laughing together here, where these pharaohs push humanity into another satanic blood ritual by Pharaoh and his Swiss WEF base of the World Economic Forum, where these international state gangsters discussed, organized, financed and executed today's Slavic wars. As I've been telling you all these years, that all these politicians of Pharaoh's nobility are all pals of each other, related through Pharaoh's Per Ah bloodline. They are all actors who rule over humanity through the lie and the white flowers in the middle symbolize Pharaoh's White House per head of Upper Egypt, the first New World Order horizontal rule in history. Imagine a political spectrum with on the one extreme side Putin's Nazi dictatorship and on the other extreme side the West's gender bender blender product in order to create a tension between the two and ultimately war. Then soon they will drop the mask and show the entire Russian people how Putin lied, how he withheld the truth about Russian kiddo soldiers sacrificed and Ukrainian civilians slaughtered by the Russian army. Like this Russian woman saying here, I'm Russian, I cry every day for Ukraine and for Russia, Putin is my enemy too. And then after that, the Russian people will be so disgusted with the old system that they will be ready to accept the West's so-called freedom of gender bender blender, do what you like, but overshadowed by the invisible total control. Also this is part of the doggy doggy leash technique. They're gonna let the Ruskies off the leash now, after decades of short leasing. There are no just two parties, Russia versus America, or Putin versus Zelensky. No, there are three parties, Russia, the West and the Masters. And the masters need a total control, blender, gender, bender, artificial intelligence, slave race. Here in this picture here on the wall behind, we see the Templars cross again, meaning it's all happening under the banner of the Knights Templars as usual. And it's not a false flag this time, but a real one. 
the Ukrainian people are okay and they don't know this. It's the enemy within on all key positions as usual. And maybe some veterans amongst you guys have also wondered why the Ukrainians haven't just executed these captured Ruski soldiers after such horrendous crimes committed against Ukrainian civilians. Wouldn't you just have whacked them and ripped their guts out instead of feeding them? We can all see what the soldier is thinking here behind who captured the Ruski here, who's getting some scoff. What are you doing? Give him back to me. I'm not finished with him yet. Well, the answer to this mystery I just gave you before. And it's all part of a big scam. Here he's saying, the Ruski soldier saying, Hello, Mum. But I'm fine. What? Yeah, I read it for you. Captured Russian soldier calls his mum to tell her how well he's been treated by the Ukrainian soldiers. Well, I can tell you, I've never seen this in any war. I, this is not normal. Must be something behind it, eh? Well, some pharaonic officers on all key positions of the Ukrainian army ordered to keep them alive as witnesses for the Freemason agenda and to tell the Russian people by real Russian soldiers how Putin's media lied, how terrible the war was for the Ukrainian civilians and how good and humane they'd been treated by the new West with US food parcels in the Ukraine. Yeah, the West is the best. Hallelujah and whatever. You remember that his father, Admiral Morrison, started the Vietnam War. The couple of hundred Ukrainian children who miserably died for Pharaoh's Freemason agenda are mere collateral damage. I read it for you. 103 Ukrainian children have died at the hands of Russian aggressors. So I read it for you. Her name was Polina. She studied in the fourth grade of school number 24 in Kyiv. Yesterday, Polina and her parents were shot, killed by Russian saboteurs in Kyiv. So who are these Russian saboteurs? Apparently there are no soldiers. I tell you folks, this is octagon of the amp of the enemy within. This is the Swiss octagon. I've seen them in action. I know what they do. They kill people from both sides, you know, in order to, um, you know, so, so people hate each other and, and the war really starts off, you know. That's what they always do. They did it in in the Syrian war. They did it in, in, in Libya, in Iraq, in, in Afghanistan. They were very active during World War II. This is what they always do. You know, they, they put on the uniform of one country and then kill the other ones and then they put on the the other uniform and then they kill the other ones again you know that's what they do this is how pharaoh and their swiss octagon of their swiss base this is how they um, they set the wars and the hatred in in action in movement you know so these russian saboteurs so polina's sister and brother are in hospitals now. Russian terrorists, the same ones, Octogon, attacked Polina and her family with the aim to terrify civilians in order to suppress civil actions of resistance 
against invasion. You know, it's, uh, both people know it, that the Ukrainian people, they have no problem with the Russian people. The Russians know it and the Ukrainians know it. You know, they're, they are like brother nations. It's the enemy within who is doing this. And it's all about the money and the power. I mean, it's Switzerland. It all, it all leads back to Switzerland, people. You know, patience used to be considered a virtue, but I'm not sure anymore if I see with what huge amount of patience they creep up on us. Like a pink list killer investing years in becoming your best friend while leaving you in the dark about the true essence of this peculiar interaction. In is out and out is in. Taking their time with lots of patience, real predator style patience. So apparently the enemy within doesn't want me to answer your comments. Making things difficult censoring my videos, deleting entire channels, and my comments disappearing. This is the reason I never answered your comments with my channel icon, and always used this expandable channel, foreseeing the possible consequences so much revealed today. So, because Foxtube is blocking my own answers to your comments in my own videos, I'll do it this way then. And I thank every single one of your 66 lovely comments on my son's music and his channel, Killian the Musician. You prefer it like this, YouTube? Well, have it your way then. There we go. So, this is Killian, my son. There's his music channel, Killian the Musician. And here are the comments. Hi, Irish Spirited Gal. Thanks for your comment. Good to know you. You've been there. We've been knowing each other for a long time now, eh? Thank you for the lovely com comments. Hi Robin, thanks for the comments. Eh? Hi Cindy, thank you for your comments. Hi Brenda, good you are here. Thank you. Hi Robert, thanks for the comments. Kiaren, thank you. Jean-Marie, thank you. Charmaine, thank you for your comments. Verzet, ver thank you. Good you're here. Good to know you. Hi, Michael. <laughs> hey, bro. Why don't you do something together with my son and make some music? I, I know you wanted to do it, but oh, he's, a bit of, he's a bit complicated. I know. Good you're here, Michael. Silent Whisper, thank you. Elora. Thank you for your comments. Hi, Nick. Thank you. I, I wanted to answer all your comments, but you know, the, well, they just won't let me. Hi, Brenda. Thank you. Good you're here. Narina, thank you. Hi, Ducky. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Shelly, thank you. Good you're here. Hi, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Tamara, thank you. Thanks for your nice comment for Killian. Ah, salut, Regine. Merci beaucoup. <laughs> Il en a 148, ça me sait bien ça. Thank you, Regine. Dank dir, Killer Spieler. Thank you. Good to here, bro. Hi, Rudy. Thank you. Hi, Face. Good. 
Hi Robert. Molto grazie a Roberto. Eh. Ah, that's me. I tried it, you know. Had another seven replies here. Um, hi GD, thank you. Hi Piper. No, we don't give up, eh? Vlasta, oh good. Thank you, Tombra. Nice comments. Knüppel aus dem Sack. Super. Dank dir. Schön, dass du da bist. Wir brauchen den Knüppel aus dem Sack gegen den Feind im Inneren, ja? Hi, Fiddler. Ah, uh, we need another Fiddler, hey? And uh, play something together. Thank you. Hi, Anthea. Good to hear here. Thank you. Hola Maria, muchas gracias. Hi Ro, thank you, you're yeah, here. Yeah. Hi Edgar, nice comment. In the Grove, thank you, good to yeah, hear. Yeah. Uh, Bright 77, thank you. Hi Alex, dank dir, gut bist du da. Müssen wir den Gulag beenden, ja? Hi Piper, thanks for subscribing to his channel. Hi Evan, bro. Uh, thank you, good you're here, bro. Hi Justin, thank you. Season, thanks. Zippy do, zippy do da. Uh, I, I, I can't answer that question. It's uh, I'm doing my best, zippy do da. Hi Denman. Good you here. Hi Nick. Thank you, Nick. Oh, that's him again. Uh, hi Joanna, thanks for the green heart. Uh, should should it be red? <laughs> uh, hello, Fred. You know, my son he is always his whole life he's been terrorized by the Swiss, you know. Uh, yeah, so they, they even took his dad away from him, everything they took away from him. And uh, now the only thing he's got left is his music, you know. It's so sad, you know. These the Swiss, they have so much hatred, it's incredible. And they already hated us before I made any videos, you know. Hi Awakening, thank you. Hello Carlos, thank you bro. Hello Moon Peach, thank you. Hello, Jan. Thank you. Anya and Tim. <laughs> uh, thank you. Donkey. South African, eh? Uh, hi, hi, Vex. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, here. Hi, Dan. Thanks, bro. Hi, Kristen. Thank you very much. Hi, Bora. Thank you. So. Okay, so this is the way YouTube wants to do it, eh? Uh, it's getting hard, you know, and I don't know how to do this with the other video, like 666. Yeah, it was 666 uh, comments the last time I I watched. So, so try to understand me if I can't comment anymore, you know, but, but I'll, I'll try to look at it, you know. Now I've got a place here. So I've got the time and um, I'll watch it. Anyway, you've got my email for the ones who really want to organize. Thank you all. So you see the, the last video, the Black Prince of Prussia on my channel, Gyuri. The last time I checked, there were 666 comments. Now it's 669. So I hope you understand that I, you know, I can't possibly do it every film answer you like this 666 times you know so uh yeah but um you know I, I wanted to keep the personal touch you know all these years you know I, I couldn't really answer all the comments I couldn't even look at it you know because I, I was sleeping in the forest and uh, now I can and it, it's even now it's impossible you know but 
Well, you got my email, eh? So, for the ones who really want to organize something. So, funny, eh? 666 comments. And here it says the Black Prince. Too bad I didn't film this when I was still 60, 666. That would have fit real nice together with the Black Prince, eh? <laughs> okay, see you next time.